Well, well. I'm good, man. How you doing? Pretty okay. <laughs> <laughs> I love this game. This is all I play now. D did you try it? Nice. How f how far along are you? Uh, the expedition? Yeah, me too. If you want, you can join me. I'm in an expedition right now. Oh yeah, the yeah the signed in fucking screen man takes ages to get you in. All right, hold on, let me. Sometimes it sometimes it's very instant. Yeah, I'm gonna change my game privacy to friends so you can join. Yeah, yeah, jump in whenever. Yeah. Yeah. That's that. Yeah, that's something a lot of people been saying that, you know, give us like an offline mode or something so people can just chill with the with the game not and, you know, you don't necessarily have to in a team or something. I I played the campaign solo first, and I I I loved it. Mm -hmm. mm, that'd be interesting. Yeah. No, I think there's there, there will be a lot more coming up. The the game is still like I don't know a month old, so not even that. So it's too early to expect new content. I mean, to be honest, I know a lot of people who haven't even who haven't even finished the story, and they're sort of uh, struggling to level up because they want to do it on a higher tier, but they can't. So I I even I go every now and then to help my friends to you know. Um, level up and you know get them better gear and stuff so i understand from their point of view as well they're giving the audience some some window to um mm -hmm. catch up mm. all right yeah It is a pain. It is a pain. Why? Ah, oh, fuck's sake. Yeah. Yeah, give me two minutes if we're over. Fifteen. Yeah, I do all of this. Solo. I made this uh, Technomancer build and oh my god I can hit 1 million with my critical with my critical shots this Technomancer is the most beefiest motherfucker in this game uh, hands down I, I have yet to see a build uh, that can fucking do more damage than the than the Technomancer I, I, I have played Pyromancer as well, and Pyromancer has some very cool builds as well that can wipe the entire room. Sort of like a status effect build, you know, um, with the fire. But when it comes to real damage with the pistol, I I have yet to see someone else who who can put out as much as much damage as uh, uh, as Technomancer do. 
Uh, trickster is, yeah, with the tricks and blades and shit. Uh, the bubble is useful with the trickster and shit. But um, Devastator is more of a like a supporting bell when, you know, pick people up and they're about to die and shit. Because he's a little bit tanky motherfucker. But apart from that, Technomancer is, is the way to go if you want to go solo DPS shit. Yeah, uh, I've been so far, I'm very impressed with with how Technomancer is and the, all the skills that you can use and shit. It's just very impressive the way they have made it. And they, they, they pe actually people got creative with it because they weren't expecting Technomancer to be this strong. They initially made Technomancer to be a supportive build as well in action. But the way people have, I think, created it, it's, it's just, it's just so strong now. Like, especially that gun that comes with the, with the pack. If you level that thing up, it's one of the strongest uh, hitting gun then. Yeah. Man, I hate these flies. Fucking flies. Come on, don't fuck up my gold. Yeah, got the gold. Tier 15 solo, bitches. Yep. 74,000 currency. And I still had my mag left. My question bullet. Yeah, I don't think I use even one mag of the normal bullets through the entire run. Only when there's a lag and shit, then I lose my bullets and stuff. Oh man, didn't get any legendary. This is so bad. So bad.